Hello everyone, welcome back to Journey with Shaw on this lovely Tuesday evening. I come to you on March 1st, 2022, y'all. I'm so excited. My child's birthday is tomorrow and I'm so excited for him. I love the month of March, of course, because he was born March 2nd. So if you all can give him a shout out down below to Joshua, it's his birthday tomorrow. Anyway, let's get right to it. I have a um, spring haul here of some fun items that I have collected and I wanted to share with you all. And so let's get started. First thing I wanna do is show you what my neighbor just um, came over and gave to us. And I thought it was the sweetest thing last night. And I wanted to show you all, she just came back from Belgium. She gave us this delicious orange marzipan and it is from Belgium, you all. And it is by Brown Sugar. I think that is the name of the company. This is the website right there, if y'all can see that. But anyway, I thought that that was so sweet. I never tried it orange flavored, so I'm just excited about that. I thought that was very sweet. The next thing that she gave us also, you all, is this beautiful um, chocolate from Belgium. And it's Home Sweet Home. And this one is, I think it's cranberries, pistachios, and dried raspberries, y'all. I don't know, but I'm just so excited. And I thought that was the sweetest thing. She said, because you guys always look out for my packages and we're just really um, cordial. We really, we love talking to each other, but I thought that was very kind for her to do that for my family. So, all right, you all. So let's get to the next items we're gonna show here. And those were gifts. So the next items, I wanna get the pillows out of the way, you all. So went to Home Goods. You all know Home Goods has the best looking pillows. And I picked this one up and she is just gorgeous. Mommy picked her out. So this is her pillow, but it's also for the family. But look how cute she is with all of the beading. I just absolutely love it. It has like a coral color um, edge, the beautiful frills on the edge is coral and the florals, but it is just gorgeous. So I'm gonna hold this back. Look how pretty she is. And then we're gonna turn it around so you all can see the back. I love the fact that it's got that beautiful gingham on the back. Isn't that gorgeous? Like a teal, light blue, teal color gingham. So I just think it's gorgeous. So I'm gonna turn it around. And it even fits with the Pioneer Woman book and her um, paper goods, but we're gonna get to that later. But anyway, how pretty is that, right? And this was for $19.99, and this is by the company, let me get this. So it's the Bunny Boulevard Spring Collection, and that is who it's by. Isn't she pretty? I'm trying to get my arm shadow out of the way, y'all. She is so gorgeous. The next one, you all, I showed this one to you on another haul, but I want to show it again to those of you, since this is a spring haul. Look how cute she is. I can't stand it. This is my favorite, and she's from Home Goods as well. I love it because of the beading of the butterflies and the flowers and her eyes and her little whiskers. She's outlined in beads and her little hair pieces beads. And then the butterfly, I absolutely love it. I love it. And then you have another butterfly here. And on the back, she's just plain um, cream colored on the back, okay? She's just cream. And I just think that she is just gorgeous. Isn't she pretty? You all, she is by Spring Gatherings and she was for $19.99 as well, okay? I just love her. And okay, and now next up, we found this other pillow. We just absolutely loved it. It's, she's just gorgeous. Now these are the only bunny pillows I'm getting right now. Um, I'm going to now just look for spring um, pillows. Now she is so fool that I can just sit her there and she's fine. But I love it because it's needlepoint. We know it's probably done by machine and not by hand because of mass production. But oh my gosh, it's just so beautiful. And I just wanted you to see, I love the pearl-like beading around um, the outline of the bunny. And I just think that it's so beautiful with the florals and the leaves. And then that beautiful gingham in the background is just a white bunny with the flowers in the gingham. It's just so beautiful. And then I love that it has these little pom-poms on the rim of the bunny, I mean on the rim of the pillow, and that is just gorgeous. Absolutely love it, okay? So that is that. All right, and then we're gonna turn it around, and she's just teal on the opposite side, okay? And she is by, let me show you, also Spring Gatherings, and she was for $19.99 as well, okay? Y'all better get to Home Goods because you know when you find these things and you don't see them no more, that's it. It's over. Okay, so I wanted to show you all the um, items that I got from Hobby Lobby. 
uh, went this weekend. They had a sale 50% off their baked goods. I hope they still have that sale on, but you guys, they always have sales. So make sure if you're a baker or you want to get into baking or maybe taking a cake class, you want to go to Hobby Lobby. They have the best stuff. So this company, Sunny Side Up uh, Bakery, they had all their stuff 50% off. So I got this 50% off. These are cake straps. So what you do, you wet these and you put them around the cake pan that you're using and you can secure it with that pin and I promise you your cakes are leveled out perfectly even there won't be that dome in the middle and these are perfect okay and there are different sizes so I was really happy that I could um, get the ones that has four different sizes and that is um, what it's called insulating strips to promote even bacon there we go and you get four and those are the sizes okay and that was for half price $9.99 Okay, the next one we have here, I love their parchment paper, and I got this um, for half price of the $5.99, and that's by that same brand, okay? And this is really good parchment paper for baking cookies and whatever else you're baking. Another thing that I was really excited about is this, the Sunny Side Up um, icing bag holder. You all, oh my goodness, when you're trying to decorate a cake, you need to have it organized so you don't have things everywhere. And so I was so happy that I was able to get this icing bag and it's elevated and I love that. All you need to do is probably just put a little paper towel under there in case anything drips or parchment paper. And it is perfect for you to just have fun and just decorate cakes or cookies or cupcakes and just have a ball so that was for $9.99 and this is the icing bags it holds up to eight bags you guys I'm so excited about that all right so we got that and that is what that looks like there again yes okay the next thing that I got from um, Hobby Lobby is um, these cute uh, cake boards, 12 counts. I have big ones, but I needed some little ones. And so this is the size for that, eight inch cakes for $5.59 and that was half price. And I also bought this adorable little cake pan. Now these little cake pans can be pricey. So you see that $7.99. Usually when you see these on sale at Michael's or at, cause you can get that 40% off at Michael's or at Hobby Lobby, run and get these. Cause these are per a beautiful, these are awesome per for personal cakes. Like I want to make one for Joshua. Personal cakes are just because you want a smaller portion when guests are coming over. You don't want a big gigantic cake. You can make these or uh, uh, make a little cake with this. You can do for birthdays, barbecues, family gatherings, um, just to gift away. You may have a friend, her birthday's coming up, you want to make her a cake. So I think that this is the perfect size for them and for others they can share with, okay? And you see how that fits. You want it to have enough room so when you're decorating, whatever falls can go there and you can transport it with the cake spatula or you can leave it on here depending on how you need. You can put parchment paper on there. All right, so there we go. And that one was for $7.99, half price. And then also, this was for $5.99 half price. All right, the next thing we got from there, oh, you guys, I have to show you. I am so excited. I had to put them all in here, y'all. I got so many colors, and they're just everywhere. I'm not gonna take them out because it'll be just too much, but I got different uh, uh, pinks, blues, I've got greens, and uh, th each one of these were for $1 and it's by that company. I'm gonna get a little box and organize it because this is driving me nuts. But oh my goodness, you guys, I was so happy um, that I was able to get this half price. So we spent 98 cents on each one and that's for 199, okay? This is awesome, I got so many. I think I got about, how many's in here? Oh Lord, it's more than nine. <laughs> All right, so if you love um, coloring, these are good it's for food, good for um, coloring icing, frosting, um, or even batter, you know what I'm saying? You can use this, these fun little colors to color your um, baked goods or whatever you're cooking, okay? All right, and those were for, and those were for 98 cents each. The next thing I have here is the bags. Remember I showed you the bag holder. I needed to have the bags. So I bought these bags, the disposable bags. These are $6.99 and they're 24 count, 12 inch. And you guys, you get so many in here. So I was like, oh my goodness, this is awesome. I wanna wake back up that talent. Me, Mom and Chrissy and I took a cake class over 10 years ago at Michael's and it was by Wilton. And we took all three series and y'all, it was amazing. We still have the books and everything. So we loved it and enjoyed it so much. So I'm gonna bake, wake back up that craft. It's really fun. So yes, that was for $6.99 and I got that half price. 
all right and then the next thing i have here is an eight by eight pan I always need an eight by eight pan good for brownies good for square cakes good for baking so period so i got these and i was just really happy that um i was able to get it half price as you can see it's 11.99 but um i got it half price for that so this is the size of the pan okay and i love these aluminum pans when you take really good care of them they can last you a very long time and the cakes just plop out of there all right and then the next thing we have here is um these this is the filling tip so whenever i as you can see right there whenever i want to fill the inside of a cupcake this is what i'll use and i said oh my goodness i need a filling tip so i thought that that was perfect and that is for 2.99 and i got it half priced okay and the last thing that we got from hobby lobby and the baked goods y'all is this i could not believe it okay it was for 199 regular 7.99 i didn't get half price but that was good enough for me this is a cookie cutter or dough cutter if you want um to make little pies little whatever it is you you, you decide to make but it's really a cookie cutter i thought it was really cute and i love baking cookies so this was all up my alley all right so that is everything for hobby lobby y'all please make sure you stop by to see what you can find at Hobby Lobby and hopefully the baked stuff is on sale this week. Okay, next thing we have before I even go into the Pioneer Woman stuff, I wanted to show you all. Mom and I are walking inside Walmart. We're going down to Al's. My Walmart has revamped itself. So they're trying to get a, way, a lot of things they're trying to get rid of a lot. And I'm looking like, what in the world's going on in these aisles? It's just all markdown stuff. So I saw some Pioneer Woman items, not really too interesting, but then I saw this one. And I said, you gotta be kidding me. So as I'm looking, it says um, that it was for, my, how much we spent, $2 on this? Yes, it, it was for 11 something right there. So the lady, that's why it pays to be nice to people. Because the lady was talking to us and we were all having a good conversation. Then we went on. When she saw me stop and look at this, she said, you know what? Let me mark that down. I'm gonna try to get it to a dollar. She said, oh, best I can do is $2. Y'all, it was regular price. Then she marked it down to that. And then she marked it down to that. I only paid two bucks for this. I was too ecstatic. Now, what I would do with this, I think would be so beautiful just to put yellow lemons in there and put them in the corner. Um, because of the inside and the paint, I want to be careful with that. But I just said, you know what? This would be gorgeous to hold yellow lemons. Can you imagine? Because that beautiful cobalt blue kind of like French blue. And I said, with that yellow, it would just be perfect in the corner in the kitchen. And whenever you want to grab a lemon, you can go ahead and grab a lemon. But this thing is huge and I absolutely love it. We do have another one, but we it's not the classic charm. Okay. It's another one. But anyway just gorgeous okay and this is the size does it say the size i don't think i don't think it says the size of it so that is that and we are just too excited about that just too excited about it okay next thing i got you guys the other day um i'm gonna finish up with the pine and woman stuff and then i'm gonna show you okay so you guys know pine and woman's items are coming out for the spring so last year i got these beautiful spring i got her spring um paper goods last year so this year i just noticed that she came out more now they look very similar to the ones last year the only reason why i knew they were different was because of the video i compared it they're completely different so this is how this one looks and it is just gorgeous. I promise you, these are so awesome. Perfect for Mother's Day. I did a Mother's Day video. I'm gonna link it down below so you can see how I did the, the set last year when I um, made a breakfast for mommy. But isn't this gorgeous? This is just so beautiful. And you get two of them in there. And I will put the link down below where you can go online and get it. And this is the size of the table um, covers, okay? And it's just gorgeous. Just look at those flowers, y'all. Just look at those beautiful flowers. And that gingham it's just so gorgeous okay so we got those okay the next thing we have here is her beautiful square napkins y'all just look at that and each one of her napkins comes with the recipe p included so before you throw it out make sure you take a screenshot of that recipe but look at this napkin it's just gorgeous the gingham, I just love it. It's just, it's completely different than her big ones last year for spring. It is just really pretty, but you can really, if you saved, um, got a set last year and still have it, you can combine both of those sets and it would just make a beautiful table setting for a picnic. These are awesome to take on a picnic. Like I said, a brunch, um, a ladies Bible study prayer meeting and you're hosting something or um, um, 
just because. Perfect for Easter, perfect for Mother's Day. Okay, they do have bunny ones. I didn't get bunnies this year because I got so many of them last year. All right, but I will link those below where you can go directly to them. But you guys, look at this gingham. Look at those flowers. Just gorgeous. And I tell you, you can combine paper goods even with beautiful things, just beautiful regular uh, setting, uh, regular um, uh, tableware, and it's just gorgeous. I'm telling you, it all come on, it comes together nicely. So yes, so that is her um, regular square, and this is 20 count, and that is the size. They're pretty big, okay? And then I'm gonna show you her guest napkins, okay? This is the guest napkins with the gingham, also with recipes included in each one of the napkins, okay? When you open them, the recipe pops, it's in there, okay? That is just so pretty. I just love it. And that is 24 count, two ply, and that is the size of the napkin. So I'm gonna bring both of them out so that you can see how they look. Isn't that beautiful? They're just so pretty. I just absolutely love her paper goods, okay? And then this is her. Now, I love this plate better than the one last year. This one's so pretty, isn't it, Mom? The colors are just gorgeous. They're a little more softer, and it's got a little bit of um, uh, coral in there with that purple and yellow. It's just really pretty with the polka dots, and I love the shapes of these, the um, beautiful scallop edge, and you get in here, you get... 12 count. Now you may have these in the store and they should be like $2.98 each. If not, you're going to have to order online and they come in a set of three of these sets. Okay. So that's pretty good deal as well. So this is eight inch 12 count. All right. And that is like the, what would you call these? Like dessert, salad, whatever you want to put in here, dessert, salad, whatever you want to put. Okay. Let's get to her 11.5 inch beautiful dinnerware plates. You can even put a cake plate on here. I was even looking at that little cake plate that I had. You can, um, cake pan, you can put a size cake in here. These things are so huge. But just look at that beautiful plate. I wish she would make these in melamine. If she did these in melamine, honey, oh my goodness, these would sell out. I would have to probably sneak in from the roof to get a set of this stuff if she sold in a melamine because it's just so beautiful. And it would be nice if we can keep a set like this, but in melamine. But I don't know if it's because of the color, more color, and it would cost more. I don't know. But anyway, so that is her 11.5. Let me show you. That again, it's eight count. And if you order this online, you're going to get three of these um, in eight count. Eight count, three pack, eight count. Okay. And that's 11.5. And let's show you that again. That is what it looks like. Isn't that pretty? It's just gorgeous. I just absolutely love it. So let me just set this back up there just like so, and then we're gonna get to this one. Now, I don't know if you guys, I don't know if I showed you her beautiful um, cookbook. Um, I got this not, not too long ago, and I said, did I even share that with them? So I wanna show you all this cookbook. This is the, perf the Pioneer Woman Cooks Super Easy. 120 shortcut recipes for dinners, desserts, and more. And I just love it. I think this is her best looking cookbook. What would you say, mommy? Mm -hmm. The colors, um, it's just really pretty. It's That's really pretty. pretty. And she did, seem like she did a lot of Tex-Mex in here. Mm -hmm. And so I'm gonna show you all what it looks like really quick. I just love that she used that yellow. That yellow with the outline teal, that's just gorgeous. And that's her. Reed's looking really good too, y'all. She's been eating eating well because I tell you, Sister Girl has lost a lot of weight. Not that she was real big, but she looks way better than she was. So that's her family. And so I love that she shows the uh, staples, the top nine must-have um, cooking staples. And I'm sure she uses this all throughout her book. I love how she shows that, how you can cut corners. And she just, it's just gorgeous. Look at that beautiful, Instapot, that's the one I have, a gorgeous Instapot. I love how she shows the items that um, she sells as well, her products, and she's using them in her cookbooks. But y'all, look at this chocolate chip scone. It's just, oh my goodness, just page after page. And you know, she's known for her step-by-step, step-by-step, -step, um, um, step she shows you what to do when um, making a recipe. That is what she's known for. She started her blog, that's how she started. And she still kept that same method. And I absolutely appreciate that. Cause sometimes you just need to know what are they doing? Okay, this is just gorgeous. So it just keeps going on and on. I mean, look at this waffle and that's her two daughters. Um, it's just, it's just, it's just beautiful. It's just a really 
pretty book. And I love that she shows, like I said, the items that she uses. I have that dinner set and that cup. And I'm just like, oh my goodness, this is just so beautiful. And then she also uses items that are not her products, mix and match, you guys. But I've seen some people do all Pioneer Woman and it's still beautiful because her stuff is just so lovely. All right, so that is what the book looks like. If y'all can tell y'all, it is an awesome book and I am so happy. This is my favorite one by far, just my favorite book. And I think she has some pictures in here of her daughter, but you guys gotta go and check that out, okay? And so that is the Pioneer Woman's Super Easy Cookbook, 120 Short Cup Recipes. And I just think it's beautiful, you guys. Isn't that lovely? It's just gorgeous, okay? All right, and the next thing we have, speaking of books, the next cookbook that I have here that I wanted to show you all is this one. So I'm walking inside of TJ Maxx and I see this cookbook. And this was maybe about a month ago. And I said, let me share them with this. Maybe about a month and a half. And I said, I don't know if I shared it. I'm gonna share these two cookbooks. But I love cooking and I love baking. And I saw this one. It's by Valerie Lomas. I believe that is her name. She is the winner of the Great American Baking Show. Okay. And let me tell you, I believe she is from New Orleans, New Orleans, for those of you who are from the South. And this is just a beautiful book. It is really a stunning book. So I just want to go in. I love that she's showing that she uses these beautiful bump pans. And speaking of bump pans, I'm going to show you guys something right after this. But I love those Nordic wear bump pans and then different other styles of bump kit pans. So that is her there. She's a really pretty girl. And that's her family. And this is just, oh, it's just gorgeous. Look at this. I want to get rid of that glare because I can't hold it up. It's hard. She shows family. I love that she tells about her history. And just that's when she was doing the Bake Off. I believe it was the Bake Off, okay? American Baking Show. And look at that cake, just gorgeous. So it's just, I'm just gonna run through this really quick. She does Hush Puppies. We all know Southern Hush Puppies. I mean, it's just amazing. Beignet Fingers, those are beignet fingers I just showed you guys. Donuts, she does beautiful cream filled donuts. Um, she shows you how to make the donuts, y'all. Just look at this book. Oh, look at that bread. Just beautiful. Is that holla bread? I don't know. I gotta see. Yeah, holla bread. And it's just those dinner rolls. I'm just gonna go through here really fast, you guys. Her friends and family. I just think it's a beautiful, beautiful um, book. Look at that cake. Just gorgeous. Just love it. And so I wanted to let you all know crawfish hand pies. Woo, that is a southern thing right there, honey. Great idea. Crawfish hand pie. Mmm. And so she's got a peach crisp and just all kinds of stuff. It's just beautiful chocolate mint moon pies. So she is definitely a Southern Belle and I am just so happy. I'm a Southern Belle myself, raised in California, but Southern Roots was born in Mississippi. So Southern Roots, but I absolutely love this and I cannot wait to try the recipe. And this book's book is just, and this book is just absolutely stunning. It's a really beautiful book, okay? And that is the back of the book too as well, all right? And yes, she got it for $10, y'all. She got it for 10, I was so happy. <laughs> so it's it's regular price $29.99, but I got it for 10 bucks. That's what I wanted to tell y'all what I was so excited about. So we're gonna put her to a side. The next book that I have here that I wanted to share you all, you know, I love, if you don't know, now you know, I love home decorating. I love home design. And one of my favorite people that I admire is Erin Lauder. She comes from the Lauder family, Estee Lauder family. This is her granddaughter. And I absolutely love Erin Lauder. And I know you people may say, well, she's wealthy, life was easy, but let me tell you she did she made her own name and let me I, and I absolutely love how she did it she has beautiful products in William Sonoma she sells beautiful clothing and bags and shoes and um, just home goods beautiful homeware she it's just she, floral she just does it all table setting she shows you how to host so this book is Aaron Lauder entertaining beautifully and I always say if you love entertaining and books on that. Let me see if I can hold this up because it's a little heavier. If you love entertaining and books on that, it's always good to get these decorating books because you can go and find items that look very similar, may not be just as much and you don't have to break the bank, but very similar and make it just as beautiful. That's her grandmother, Estee Lauder, okay? And I just love that wallpaper. That wallpaper and that just, that my, mantle is just, <laughs> I'm too done. I love the sconces on the wall. That is just all me. It's just so beautiful. And she just shows, look how she's entertaining there. Just beautiful. Look at that. 
just stunning. And you can get so many ideas of how to make your home beautiful and you don't have to, it doesn't have to cost as much as, um, it may be, if, you know, like the wealthy. But look at this table setting. I mean, you can get those chairs. I'm sure many places you can get light chairs similar to that. But I just think it's just a beautiful book. Look at those kumquats. And here in Southern California, we really grow a lot of citrus. And I just love when they bring it inside the house or inside your um, or on the outside your back porch. These are just so gorgeous. Just beautiful, the kumquat trees. So yes, I love it. And that is Erin there. And I just love it. Just beautiful. She's one of my favorites. So, yes. Look at the um, inside of her book, y'all. Just beautiful. Stunning. So, I got this book half price off of Amazon if you're interested. Um, because I think these are how, ways that you can help when you don't know what to do in your home. You're, you're your own style. It's your own style. You're your own designer. I always say create your home in your environment the way you want it, what makes you happy. But it's also good when you can get good ideas from other um, designers or other people you may see on Instagram or um, 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 or on YouTube, you can mix and match or you can just always get good ideas and make your table and your home just as beautiful. Okay, so that's Erin Lauder. This book was for $25. I got a half price, y'all. I was so happy. Okay, now, y'all know, let me get into what I said about the cake pan. So I follow this, um, yes, I know, right? Just Stunning. So I follow this Facebook group. It's called Pound Cake Chicks. And I saw one of the young ladies, she posted, and it's women in the United States, but all around the world. And one of the ladies posted this, um, and she did a red velvet cake. I was like, oh my goodness. Everyone was asking her, where in the world did she get that pan? She said, oh, I got it years ago. So I'm on the hunt, like, you gotta be kidding me. Nordic wear pan with flowers. Nordic wear pan. Then it popped up on eBay, and I just saw two. And I said, oh my goodness. So I got one of these, got a good deal. Probably had to pay a little bit more because they're there. You can't find them as much. So ha paid a little more. So I understand the seller had to get a profit. But oh my goodness, you guys look at this. I can't stand it. I showed it on Instagram. Those of you who follow me on Instagram, you've already seen this. But oh my goodness, you all look at this beautiful just look at the flowers. And it reminds you of those European cookies they make during Christmas, which I don't know which, um, is, is it Swedish or is it Danish? I don't know who is it that does that beautiful cookies. They look like this, very similar. Let me know below if you know. But look at the shape of this pan. And it is just gorgeous. The crevices, you just know. That cake came out in very detailed. And you see by the crevices why it came out with excellent detail. So I cannot wait to use this and I'm just so happy and I'm gonna cherish this for many years to come. And I just wanted to share you all this gorgeous cake pan. I was so happy that I was able to get my hands on one. All right, now you all know she loves her. <laughs> Y'all know she loves her dash. So let me show you my newest dash finds. All right. Let me put the books back here. All right, y'all, so let me show you my newest dash finds. She is too excited. Okay, I collect the dash ones. So if you always say, if you all, if you guys ever say, why does she always have a dash? Because I collect them. I collect them for future grandchildren. And I just think they're fun to have when you have guests over and it may be, you know, who knows? You can just put the different little dashes out and they can make their own little waffles. It's just fun to do with kids and family and just fun to do with yourself. You know, if you want a cute waffle and it's portion control, why not do a cute shaped one? Anyway, so I am so excited about this one. This is the new Star Mini Waffle Maker. And I'm gonna be making some waffles with this next video coming up very soon. So this is the star shaped one and it's so cute. I just cannot stand it. Perfect for the 4th of July. You use your blueberries and your strawberries and raspberries. You can even put brownie mix in here and just really make a cute little um, brownie sundae. It's just gorgeous. And look at the star. It's too cute. I will put the link down below for these if you're interested. This one is the Honeycomb Mini Waffle Maker. Absolutely love it. Cannot stand it. And each one of these are four inches in surface. They're nonstick, so you don't have to use a spray. And they're 350 watts. I use butter so that I don't have to use butter afterwards. It's already in there. Okay. And so this is the one with the bee and it's the honeycomb. You guys know if that syrup and butter gets stuck in that honeycomb, that is dangerous, right? <laughs> so anyway, this is the honeycomb. I did buy one of these also for a co-worker and she loves bees like I do. Because I, I just think bees are just... 
very important to our environment and I just think that they are just cherished and I just love um, the honeycomb shaped. It's just really, really cute and the yellow. So that's how deep those, cre those crevices are. And I will show you guys, I'm going to be making some waffles soon. So you'll see that. So that's the star and the honeycomb. And then guess what? This is the month of the Irish, right? I just found out y'all, I did a test, uh, um, ancestry test. And I just found out that I am 8% Scottish and I think three or 4% Irish and happened to be 1% Italian, which I was like, what? And then I was 1% Sri Lankan. And also you guys, I'm 34% Nigerian and along with some other African countries, but I'm just too excited. 34% Nigerian y'all. So anyway, <laughs> that is a little bit of my makeup. But anyway, so this is for those of you who celebrate St. Patty's Day. This is too stinking cute. Too stinking cute to pull these out and just make, you can make little sandwiches, grilled cheese sandwiches with these and little ham and cheese sandwiches, ham, um, uh, just be waffles, just be creative. I mean, just the cutest. You can even dye the dough and just make green little waffles. Too cute. So I'll be doing that soon, so stay tuned. Okay, last but not least, that is in this haul. So this is the new Rise Personal Ice Cream Maker, y'all, and it's by Dash. I'm so excited because sometimes Joshua and Mommy want a full fat milk um, ice cream. I don't. I may want an almond milk. I may want something lighter. I may just want a different flavor. And so this is perfect for anybody that doesn't want what everybody else wants. Maybe they want a yogurt or maybe they just want ice cream, you know, but that's a different flavor and more healthier. So this is awesome. A year warranty, two years serves one and cup capacity is for one. So that is what, this is what I love about it. Small portions, you guys, one cup capacity. Okay, and then this is the little ice cream maker. It is the cutest thing. The only thing I didn't like is you have to hit this QR code when you want the recipes. Wasn't too fancy about that. Okay, I wish they included a, a book. So this is what it has here on the side. Okay, and of course you put the base in the freezer and this is what that has on the back, okay? And it's like I said, this is how you get the recipes. Not not really fancy about that. So if you want to see what it looks like, I'm going to have a, a video coming up soon where I'm doing strictly this ice cream. And then I'm going to have a video where I'm using this ice cream machine. And then I'm going to have a video coming up soon where I'm using each one of these waffle makers so that you can see the shape and you can decide if which one you like or if you like all three like I did. Okay, before we end, I have to show you Pinky. Y'all, look how she is just flourishing. Joshua bought this for me like around Valentine's Day, a week before Valentine's Day, or a couple of days. Look how she, listen, I am so excited about this green thumb of mine that is developing. I'm just too happy about this. Look how beautiful she is, you guys. She is just gorgeous, just stunning. Her, she blooms every single day. She just stays bloomed and she's blooming more and more. I'm just so excited. If you saw how she looked on one of my pictures before, then you would know that she has bloomed a lot. She's a succulent because of the shiny here. So I've been cleaning that off too as well. And she doesn't take much water, water. as long as she stays damp, that's it. You don't wanna immerse her in water and keep it in there. You wanna make sure you, you um, I water her and then I drain her and then put her back in. I put a paper towel even to catch extra water. And then she stays moist here. And when I see she's drying, I just add the water. But I always have her near um, the window so she's getting good sun. But I'm just so excited. Those of you who have three green thumbs, Y'all, give me a heads up. Give me a thumbs up down, down below. Let me know if I'm doing pretty good. I'm so happy about how pretty she is and how long she's lasting. All right, you all, so that is everything for this haul. I hope you enjoyed it. And if this is the first time you ever seen my channel and you like what you see, please hit that subscribe button. Make sure you also hit the notification bell. Every time I upload a new video, it will alert you and you can come and check me out. You all, thank you so much for tuning in. You all take care of one another. And remember, always try Trust God, keep him first, and he'll always lead you in the right direction. I'll see you soon. God bless. Bye-bye. And this is the size of the ice cream maker.